Hi. So we're going to do a little bit of shaking now, uh, which is a really, really useful way to release uh, tension from your body when we have a lot of worry around. Our body expresses that by holding tight. Um, and having a good old shake is a great way to release some of that. Releasing tension from your body can help to ease things in the mind a little bit as well. So before you start, just take a moment to stand and if it's comfortable to close your eyes, you can close your eyes just to bring your attention inside a little bit. If you prefer to keep your eyes open, by all means do. And see if you can just get a sense of how things are feeling in your body right now. So you might notice places that are feeling tension. You might notice how your breath feels. And notice how connected you feel to the ground. So how aware of your feet are you? And we don't need to do anything to change any of this. We're just noticing how things are to begin with. And then when you're ready, bring your attention right down to your feet, contact with the earth and give yourself a little shift side to side. Just feel your weight shifting side to side from foot to foot. And then see if you can come back to rest somewhere that's a little bit more balanced than the place that you began. So your weight spread a bit more evenly. Great. Make sure you've got a nice wide stance, as wide as your hips, maybe even wider. And then have a little soft bounce in the knees. So we're just reminding our knees that they can be soft. They don't need to lock and be hard. And then we're going to begin to invite a little bit of shaking into the body. So I'm going to do that by shaking my knees backwards and forwards, one at a time. You can have a little experiment to see if you can find the speed that works for you so that you can find a little rhythm. And I'm just thinking about moving my knees, but the more that I relax my body, the more that movement kind of travels up through the body. So notice how things are feeling in your hips right now as you shake the knees. You might notice some movement coming into the spine. And then you can really let go all the way up. So you can even invite your shoulders to have a bit of a wiggle. Ooh. And just being really interested in how this movement kind of changes. So if you take your attention into your shoulders, if I come into my shoulders and start thinking about shaking there, things get a little stiller down below. So can I invite my knees to keep going and my shoulders to get a bit wiggly. Great. And as my shoulders get wiggly, my arms start to get involved because my arms are connected to my shoulders. So I'm not thinking about moving my arms, but just shaking the shoulders allows the arms to go. And then if we think about the arms, just take a moment to bounce through the knees. Let your arms be really heavy. So your arms can let go completely, all the way from the shoulders. The elbows are really soft. And then have a little bit of a shake through the arms. So really imagine that you're flicking water off your hands. Right, anything that needs to let go. You know. Let go all the way down through the arms, through the hands. Lovely. And now that those arms are nice and loose and swingy, let's have a little bit of a twist to free things up in the spine. So we're just going to turn the chest from side to side and let the arms just come along for the ride. So the arms are long and heavy. They're not doing anything active. They're just wrapping around the body from side to side as we softly bend the knees. And then coming back to centre. Have another little shake through those knees. And notice what happens in your breath as you really give your body permission to shake. 
I often find some big out breaths might suddenly turn up. I'm not trying to do that. They just come. It helps me realize that I might have been holding my breath. And a little shake and then shake your hands all the way up. And if it's comfortable for your back, you can come down, shake down and up and then back to the center. And then you can keep going as long as you like, as long as it feels good. But when you feel ready, just come gently to a pause again. You might really slow the movement down steadily and coming into a little bit of a sway. And then just scan through your body again and notice how you're feeling now. So notice maybe some of those places that you felt tension to begin with. How are they doing now? Has that changed? Is it the same? How is your breath now? My breath feels a little bit easier. But I can certainly feel my heart, heart rate has raised. And how is your connection with the ground? Can you feel the ground underneath your feet? Can you feel your legs? your feet a little bit more clearly. Great. So if that feels useful, any time you feel things beginning to build, if things are beginning to feel kind of physically or mentally a little bit too much, find yourself a quiet place and just give your body permission to shake and let it go. And um, yeah, I hope that helps. Thank you.